Uh, the federal government has charged has been charged to investigate all cases of missing persons, including the enforced disappearances arising from insurgency. The call was part of the commemoration of the yearly solidarity and campaign for victims of enforced disappearance across the country in Maiduguri, the Bruno State capital. Adamo Ngulde has more. Speaking at the event, Country Director Amnesty International Malam Isa Sanusi said there was need to intensify the campaign against the government's defending silence on the fate of victims of enforced disappearances in the region. Need to intensify the campaign against the government's defining silence on the fate of victims of enforced disappearances in the region. He said the number of missing and enforced disappearances was much higher. Urging the authorities to implement the Convention for the Protection of All Persons from Enforced Disappearance effectively. We are calling on the Nigerian government to investigate all enforced disappearances of the thousands of people since the beginning of the insurgency in the northeast Nigeria and trace the whereabouts of women, children, and older people whose whereabouts have not been known for as much as 14 years, some eight years. Besides the law, he urged the federal government to ensure through investigation of enforced disappearances and ensure that suspects are prosecuted in accordance with international standards. The director Al Amin Foundation, Hamsatu Al Amin, said the foundation has recorded over 23 missing persons during the 14 year crisis in the Northeast. As I am speaking now, we have over, registered over 23,000 people missing. But the heartwarming thing is that recently, in the last two years, the leadership of particularly the Nigerian military has started releasing some of these victims to us. Some of the victims urge the government at all levels to investigate all cases of missing persons, including the enforced disappearances arising from the insurgency since 2009 to date. I will speak on behalf of the people of our town of Andara in Kumshe Bama town. About nine years ago, my brother and my husband's brother went out, but up till now no one knows what happened to them. Therefore, we are urging the government at all levels to intervene so that to know the future of our brothers and sisters. They arrested them in Burma in our, in our home. They took them to Burma Barrett. From there, they transferred them to the Maimadari Barrett. From then, we have no idea of them. Stakeholders urge Nigerian authorities to also provide effective protection for persons who file complaints of their missing persons and enforce disappearances as well as families of the disappeared person. From Meduguri, Adamu Ngulde, Trust TV News.